What is going on? It's your boy G's playing again. With new players joining the Ragnarok Origin community, I decided it was time to make a video about the Helheim dungeon. This video will provide my tactics and my recommendation for Helheim in general, as well as some tips and tricks for some of the Helheim dungeons. So without any further ado, let's get started. Helheim has two different modes, normal and hard. Doing this dungeon in hard mode will give you better rewards but at a higher difficulty. I still recommend doing Helheim in hard mode to maximize your blueprints. This week's Helheim in Valkyrie was the Ant Hell dungeon. But before I get into the dungeons, I want to share my recommendation for party members. Depending on which dungeon you'll be clearing, it is highly recommended to always have a tank and a healer. You can also substitute the Paladin and High Priest for a Clown, Gypsy, or a Lord Knight. From there, dungeons such as Horus and Drake, I highly recommend an AoE type class like High Wizard or Whitesmith. Aside from that, any DPS dealer or high burst damage class will be ideal. Usually, my favorite team to run Helheim is myself, a Paladin, a Whitesmith, a Lord Knight, and two High Priests. Having two High Priests makes up for not having a High Wizard on your team. You can have one go Magnus while the other one goes full support, but at the same time, both of them can heal if needed. On the other hand, if you have a whale of a champion, they can easily one or two shot majority of the Helheim bosses at later levels. But in the early stages of this game, especially in new servers, I like running this team. Now let's go over some tips and tricks. Always pay attention to the attack patterns of the end bosses. They all have different movesets and each boss has a unique feature to them. For example, Doppelganger will always cover one fourth of the entire playing field in poison. So you have to quickly finish the boss before the entire playing field gets covered. Or the Horus boss will turn your lights off and he'll be immune to all attacks until you turn it back on. Each boss will also have at least 4 different types of attack. You can see the danger zone of each attack by looking at the red areas. Make sure you dodge those areas as best as possible so that you don't get killed. As far as equipment is concerned, having the latest level blueprint equipment is always going to be helpful. At the early levels of the game, I do recommend Rice Ball to increase your maximum HP, especially if you're playing classes that are considered class cannons. But at later levels, make sure you're equipped with the correct gear sets and cards. Knowing the attribute of the Helheim you are fighting would definitely help you on the long run. Overall, Helheim does get easier as you level up, but with new dungeons being constantly added every episode, Helheim will definitely get a lot harder than before. If you guys want, I can make a simple tips and tricks video for each Helheim dungeon, showcasing their attack patterns and my recommendation for them. Just let me know if you want that in the comments. But anyways, I hope you enjoyed this short and simple guide on Helheim dungeons. Nothing too crazy, but again, if you want more in-depth video guys, I got you. Anyways, if you did enjoy it, please consider subscribing to the channel and liking this video. I always appreciate all of you guys, so please stay safe and I'll see you next time.